Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, holds an informal yet crucial role within the monarchy, particularly when it comes to King Charles. Often operating under the radar, the 58-year-old Duchess has become one of King Charles' secret weapons, undertaking important visits that might not garner as much attention as those of more senior members of the royal family. Recently, Sophie embarked on a four-day trip to Iraq, shedding light on the challenges faced by Iraqi women and girls. This significant journey was kept under wraps, undisclosed until its completion, due to security reasons. It was carried out at the request of the Foreign Commonwealth and Development Office in support of the Women, Peace and Security Agenda, demonstrating the Duchess's dedication to making a positive impact. Richard Eden, the diary editor for the Daily Mail, shed light on the lack of media coverage surrounding Sophie's recent visits, particularly her trip to Iraq. In his Palace Confidential newsletter, he highlighted the limited attention these visits received. Eden mentioned Sophie's previous trip to South Sudan in 2020 and the, demonic and the Democratic Republic of the Congo, which also flew under the media's radar. During her four-day visit to Iraq, Sophie spent two days in Baghdad, continuing her work as a champion for survivors of conflict-related sexual violence. Despite the Foreign Office's advisory against travel to most provinces in Iraq, Sophie managed to visit a high school, engaging with students and teachers to promote education for young women in the country. Furthermore, she had the opportunity to speak with local women, understanding their aspirations and hopes for the future. Sophie also visited a family planning centre, gaining the insights into the support available for women's reproductive health in Iraq. It's important to note that Sophie is not the first member of the royal family to visit Iraq. King Charles, then the Prince of Wales, visited military personnel in Basra in 2004. Additionally, at the age of 85, the late Prince Philip made a surprise visit to Basra to meet British troops, emphasising the family's unwavering support for the military. Since joining the royal family in 1999, Sophie has quietly established herself as a pillar of support and a valuable asset to the royal family. Her informal yet essential role allows her to work diligently in causes close to her heart, without the burden of excessive media attention. Her dedication and commitment to humanitarian work is undeniable and her influence within the monarchy is on the rise. As Sophie continues to take on important roles and undertake impactful visits, her contributions to the royal family's mission will become increasingly apparent. She is a secret weapon deployed by King Charles to shine a light on crucial issues and make a difference where it matters most. Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, is a force to be reckoned with and her influence will undoubtedly shape the future of the monarchy.